Shocking new video tonight from inside an MBTA station. Two people who work for a T contractor get into a confrontation with a blind man. And at one point, one of those workers throws the man's cane out of reach. Well, those two workers who are hired as service ambassadors have since been fired. Good evening. I'm Katie Brayson for Paula. And I'm Liam Martin. The blind man says that he was humiliated by what happened. WBZ's Tiffany Chan is live at Transit Police Headquarters in Boston. Tiffany. Liam and Katie, I spoke with that blind man today. Jerry Tolbert said he was just trying to catch the tea and that he feels disrespected. A customer service ambassador of all people would treat him so aggressively. MBTA surveillance cameras caught the whole scuffle on video as two service ambassadors working the Chinatown tea station refused to let a blind man through the fair gate without a pass. The rider, Jerry Tolbert, says he felt to nudge and dropped his walking stick. That's when one of the service agents picked up the stick and intentionally tossed it out of range. A lot of humiliation, a lot of um, disrespect, you know what I'm saying? And shouldn't, 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 shouldn't came to that. Tolbert is both blind and homeless. He tells WBZ News it was a frightening couple of minutes. You know, I got other issues I'm dealing with, you know, like being homeless and then being on the street and then being blind. And so I'm facing, you know, a lot of obstacles. These service ambassadors are employed by Block by Block, a private company hired by the MBTA to help riders navigate the T safely. The company took swift action by firing the two agents hours after the incident. The MBTA's interim general manager says the MBTA is deeply saddened by the contractor's completely unacceptable behavior and the team moved immediately to ensure these individuals were terminated. The T is now requiring block by block to retrain all of their employees who interact with riders. As for Tolbert, he just wants to feel safe again. I'm out here on the streets and I'm homeless and, 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 I, and I, 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 I want to be secure with myself you know, and around others, you know what I mean? And transit police are now taking a closer look at the incident. Block by Block has a $4 million contract with the state to staff up to 20 MBTA stations with these service ambassadors. Live in Boston tonight, I'm Tiffany Chan for WBZ News.